Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Isaiah Warlock here. This video is going to be a Scar Lore tutorial. I got a request on my 20 voices video to do a tutorial for Scarlord, how to make your voice sound like Scarlord, and I'm going to be showing you how to do that with just your voice and also how to mix it in software to get that classic Scarlord sound. If you haven't already seen my 20 voices video, go check it out on my channel. It's called One Kid 20 Voices, and I do a bunch of screaming, so like metal and trap metal kind of, uh, of uh, artists, and Scarlord is one of them. So if you want to see a a long kind of impression of Scholar that I can do, go check that out, it's on my channel. So without further ado, let's get into talking about how to do the screen. Alright, so I'm going to show you three vocal techniques that Scarlord does. Obviously he raps a lot, but I'm going to be showing you three um, kind of screaming techniques that he does. And it's three different ones. Two of them are very easy. Anybody can do them. One is a little more complicated and it'll take some practice. I'll show you the more complicated one first, and it's called a fry scream. Now, I've seen some people say that Scarlord doesn't do a fry scream, that he does some other kind of scream, like a false chorus scream or whatever. As far as my ears can tell when I listen to him, he does do a fry scream. He just pushes on it really hard. Okay, so typically, a fry scream sounds like this. Yeah! Or like this. Or like... Okay, those are all fry screams. But what Scarlord does is he pushes the fry scream to the point where you get kind of a note underneath. So it's like he's singing. He's not really singing, but it's like he's yelling with this fry scream on top of it. So first of all, I will show you how to do a normal fry scream. And this will take some practice, but you want to make this sound first. Uh, okay? Everybody can make that sound. It's just like when you're when you're sleepy and you first wake up and you're like, uh, uh, does that sound like this, right? Uh, no, I don't want to get out of bed. Uh. All right, just make that sound. Just be like, uh... If you just kind of talk quietly and in the low register, you'll get that sound automatically. So it just kind of sounds like this. And slowly over time, make that sound, uh, and then push it a little bit harder. Uh, uh, and just go, it'll take quite a while. It took me several months to get to the point where I could do it uh, front quite well. But just every, just go pushing it a little bit harder, a little bit harder, so it'll sound like, uh, uh, Okay, and there's the fry scream. Now, how do you make it sound like Scarlord? You take that same sound and you push on it with your diaphragm. So your diaphragm is this muscle back here. So first of all, try making this, try making this sound. Ah! Okay, just try kind of singing a note really high and really loud. Ah! Or even a bit lower if you can't hit that high. Ah! Right? Now do that, and if once you've mastered the fry scream, that sound, put that on top of it. So it's gonna sound like this. So that's so that's what Scarlord does, and he'll stay up in pretty high register, like yeah, yeah! oh yeah, and I'll do some classic Scarlord ad libs. Die! 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 <laughs> All right, so that is how you get that sound. Next, I will show you the two other sounds that kind of screams that Scarlord does. The next one is fairly easy and it's similar to what I just showed you, but instead you don't really put that fry on top of it. So what sometimes what he'll do is he'll be rapping and then he'll kind of yell at the end. And he likes to scream at the end too. He'll be like, But then other times he'll, he'll rap and then he'll just kind of yell and he'll just kind of push. So that that's another thing that he does. So he's like, Okay, so that's just kind of yelling without the fry scream on top of it. So it's like the first step of a fry scream, of his of the fry scream he does, but don't put the fry on top of it, just push really hard. So you go, yeah! Ah! And it's just kind of a natural yell kind of scream. The third kind of scream that he does is more of a growl, and as far as I can tell, when he does growls, he doesn't do them very often, but every now and then he'll go like, <coughs> or you! But very rarely he'll do this, but he does do this. And I think the way he's doing it is not fry, because when you do a fry that low, this is what it sounds like. Okay, it's a very sharp sound, and you can't really go very low or very loud. But when he does it, it's, it sounds very, uh, very full. 
and it doesn't sound like he's doing a false chord growl, which is a more common kind of growl. It sounds like he's just doing a, kind of a natural growl, which is actually really bad for your voice. So you don't want to do this too much, but I'll show you how to do it. So when you cough, there's a few ways to kind of get to the sound. So if you cough, <coughs> you're doing a little bit of a growl at the beginning. <coughs> so try to cough, and then just that sound that you make at the beginning, try to keep that going. So, <coughs> Okay, and get used to making that sound. And that's just your that's just your vocal cords rattling, and that's really bad for your throat. But if you just do a little bit, you'll be fine. So I hear people on the internet calling this the Cookie Monster voice. I don't actually know what Cookie Monster sounds like. I can't remember, but I'm assuming it's something like that. So you just want to do that cough sound. There's a bunch of ways you can get to the sound, but just get to the point where you're just rattling your throat around, and then you can sound like uh, Scar Lord's growls. Now I'm going to show you how to mix this. So once you've recorded, if you're doing a cover, scroll or call it cover or whatever, or you just want to sound a little bit like him, once you've done your screams and you've done all your vocals, put it in a program. Um, for this, you could even use Audacity, which is free. Anybody can get Audacity. It's very easy to use. You could use any other DAW as well. So you want to go into your DAW. I'm, I'll be showing you how to do this on Audacity, but you can look up tutorials on how to do these things in any DAW. It, they're all very simple. So to sound like Scarlord, I'm going to tell you two effects that Scarlord will put on his vocals and how he uses them to get that classic Scarlord sound. So bring your vocal in. <laughs> Highlight everything and put a little bit of overdrive distortion on it. You could use other kinds of distortion as well, but overdrive is just the easiest. And you're not going to put very much in at all. Just use a soft overdrive or a medium overdrive and just put a little bit on just to the point where the vocal is fattened up a little bit. You don't want to sound, you don't want to make it sound super, super distorted. It's just a little bit. Once you've done that, select whatever portion you want, and then you're going to put delay on it. In Audacity, delay is called echo. Delay just means echo. Sometimes it's called delay, sometimes it's called echo. They're, the, they're exactly the same thing. You're going to put this on it, and you want to give it about a one second delay, and have it be about a 0.5 decay. That means that every time it plays, after the scream, it's going to be half as loud every time, and then it's going to go away. And you can mess around with that. In some DAWs, it'll be set up automatically to match the delay with the tempo of the song, and that's really good. In Audacity, you kind of have to do that manually, which is fine as well. Okay, thanks for watching guys. Thanks for watching my Scarlord tutorial. I hope you learned from it. I will be making a video specifically on how to do a fry scream. Um, I know that my explanation of it in this video was kind of short, but I'll go into much, much more depth in my fry scream tutorial video. If you did enjoy the video, please consider subscribing. It's free and you can unsubscribe whenever you want. So you might as well, it helps me out a lot. Okay guys, see you later. Have fun sounding like Scarlord.